finding private companies' financials. Unlike public companies, private companies are not required to file their financials or anything else with the Securities and Exchange Commission. Because of this, finding financial information for private companies is much more difficult than for public companies. You won't find a neatly outlined balance sheet or income statement. You'll have to find little bits of information on the company's website and in a variety of library databases in order to make an informed assessment about the company's financial well-being. The first place to check is a company's website. If we're lucky, a large private company like PricewaterhouseCoopers here will highlight revenues for various parts of their business. In some cases, like this one, they don't make its location particularly obvious if you're just browsing their main web page, but I googled for something like the company name plus annual report or year-end review, and that will often find the report if it exists. You'll also want to check these library databases. Watch the Accessing Library Databases video if you don't know how to get to these. Reference Solutions is a great starting point for finding information on small companies if they're U.S.-based. Click the U.S. Businesses module on the home page. I'm going to search for the Sweet Spot Bakery in Whitewater. You may need to filter or refine your search further to get exactly the right location. Look at the Business Demographics section to find expected sales volume as well as a credit score rating. Further down is a Business Expenditures section. Please note that all the numbers given here are not exact because the company doesn't have to release exact numbers. These are estimated expenditure ranges for the type and size of business you're viewing. Next, check both of the library's article databases. Watch the Using Library Databases video for more tips on navigating these two business article databases. For example, here are my results in ProQuest 1 Business when I searched Trader Joe's Sales and limited to news, magazines, or trade journals. You're most likely to find analysis of a company or its financial state in news or magazine articles, trade journals, or sometimes reports, so filter to those first. Finally, it can be helpful to understand the broader industry the company you're researching is in. Use IBISWorld for that. For example, if I want information about Bass Pro Shops, I could look at the Sporting Goods Stores Industry Report in IBISWorld. The Industry at a Glance tab provides the overall average revenue and profit of the industry, plus a SWOT. The Industry Outlook tab will provide some predictions on how the industry is expected to perform in the future. The Major Companies tab will provide revenues and income numbers for some of the largest companies in the industry. Here, Bass Pro Shops is among the biggest three so there's a paragraph with financial estimates. Finally, the Key Statistics tab lists some other financials and ratios for the industry as a whole. You can even change this drop-down menu to get the financial ratios that are expected for a company of a certain asset size. We know Bass Pro is big, its revenue is definitely in the billions, so we'll look at those ratios. These ratios do not necessarily hold true for Bass Pro specifically, but for the industry as a whole, this is what they expect for assets and expenditures for a company of that size. After searching a variety of sources, you'll be better able to synthesize your findings and make inferences about the financial state of the private company you're researching. Remember that no matter where you find information, it needs to be cited in order to be used ethically. Here's a quick reference page for how to cite the sources we've looked at in this video in APA 7th edition. The company profile in Reference Solutions the industry profile in IBISWorld, and the info from a company's web page. Use this as a template for your own citations. If you have any questions, please contact the library. We're happy to help.